today we will discuss about the inheriting window forms in dotnet application now we'll move on to code open visual studio file new project select window form application and click ok form is created then drag and drop two button name it as parent form name it as in inherited form <coughs> then create one more form name it as parent parent click add change the background color of this form to red color and add a button parent click double click on this button message box dot show of parent click semicolon then go to this form create an object for parent p equal to new of parent then using the object p dot show the form then build the solution if it is succeeded then debug so parent form click the message box then create one more form add window form select inherited form name it as inherited inherited click add now which form you need to inherit select parent and click ok so the inherited form is that is the features of parent will be available in the inherited form that is the background is red color followed by the parent click now you can change this form name into inherited inherited right then add an extra feature here that is child click
click then add a code message box dot show child click semicolon next go to this and add inherited inherited i equal to new inherited semicolon i dot show yeah show then build and build succeeded debug so parent form is already then click on inherited form you can click it here click this this is child form suppose if you want to modify this we cannot move this that is it is already locked that means this function is private you need to uh, change this access specified to protected then you can modify the corresponding click event so go to the parent designer parent designer double click change this private into protected protected now the inherited class can access the method now debug and inherited build that is change this parent button click access specifier private to protected then rebuild now you can click on this inherited design how we can modify this now double click this you can add a code message message box dot show of now inherited inherited parent click rebel debug parent click this is parent and if you click on the inherited parent first parent click followed by the inherited parent click so the parent method is also called as well as the child similarly for child child click this way inheriting process done in ci.net thanks for watching